Hello friends and thank you for joining me for today's Dragon Art Room Draw Jeju Creepy Crawler Edition. We are going to be drawing a silverfish. Now silverfish are one of the first animals that crawled out of the ocean and onto the water. We're going to start with our um, paper in a horizontal position. You can draw this as big as small as you want. Uh, I draw on two dots pretty far away from each other and I'm using a pencil to draw the shape of an eye, so a rounded line on the top and the bottom. And I'm drawing, I'm going to draw it with marker just because it's easier to see, but you can use pencil. So the that's going to be the top and the bottom of our body, and we're going to draw those creepy little scales that they have going across their body. And I'm drawing his, his tail right there, and then I'm just going to um, jump over and draw his eyeball. And then from there, I'm going to draw that first portion of his slinky body. Now, I'm going to use an overlapping technique so it looks like each new creepy little scale that I'm drawing on this silver fish's body is in, um, behind the one in front of it. I drew the guided lines just to help me, but I'm going a little bit above and below each one. Now that I have his body drawn, I'm going to draw his antennas coming out of his head. I'm... They aren't straight like a bug's antenna. They've got a little bit more of a curve to them and then I draw those little dots at the end and now it's time for their weird little legs. These little legs scurry across the rocks and I'm using two rectangles to help me angle them. So I draw the first rectangle and then the second one. They're very thin and as the legs get bigger and I see that their feet change a little bit more, I add an extra one on. So I'm making sure they're not going just up and down but they're kind of at an angle. Now that I've finished with his legs, I'm going to add on um, his tail, where the back, uh, I don't know what that is called, the weird little pokey thing in the back of his, his body. And it's got kind of a, a Y, so he's got, uh, coming out of his tail, it looks like there's two Y pieces added on. And then from there, I'm going to make this little creepy crawler draw along. On a rock. Now he also has a polka dot pattern on his back and the colors that I've used to draw the silverfish are not accurate. So he's got more of a, a gray and a little bit of a, a yellow tone to him but I went ahead and added teal and green just to make him fun. I can't wait to see what you guys are gonna create. Post your silverfish drawings to Seesaw so I can see.